Who are you? It seems we're locked in. The rule against proceeding without fighting is still in effect. Uh, are you Kirijo-san by any chance? Risei got in touch with me. I am indeed Mitsuru Kirijo. As I recall, you were the sister com... Uh, no, your name was... Narukami. There doesn't seem to be anything scrambling our senses. Do you understand what I'm saying? Risa told me you were out to save Miss President. Labrys, her name was? That's right. But I must act swiftly. There's no noise here because our enemy thinks we'll be hesitant to fight in our right minds. Would you mind conceding? I don't want to drag you into this any further. I understand, but I can't do it like that. If the rules are still in effect, my friends are still trapped. They still need someone to rescue them. I fought battles I didn't want and taken on a lot of responsibilities, which includes saving Labrys, of course. It's not that I don't believe you, but I don't think it's right to simply hand the burden over to someone I just met. I see. Sorry, this must be frustrating to you. No, don't misunderstand me. I have no objections. I admire your willingness. With the final battle awaiting ahead, perhaps it's best that the stronger of us two should be the one to proceed. I like the look in your eyes. I will test your resolve with my sword. I've won. I will move on. But first, I have something to ask you. You said that you want to save Labrys too, but you barely know her. She isn't human and has been through things that aren't easy to understand. What were you going to do for her when you found her? Nothing in particular. But I could have stood at her side at the very least. At her side? You really do remind me of an old friend. I do? Yes. Though he's more than just a friend. I owe my life to him. Well then, I'll be going now. To save Labrys. Yeah, me.